In the cold, dense forests of North America, a stealthy predator roams. The Canada lynx, Lynx canadensis. With its thick fur, tufted ears, and large yellow eyes, this elusive feline is perfectly adapted to the harsh environments of the boreal forests, from Alaska through Canada and into the northern United States. Standing about 24 inches at the shoulder and weighing between 18 to 31 pounds, the Canada lynx is smaller than some of its relatives, like the Eurasian lynx, but no less formidable. Its body is built for life in the snow. With long legs and large, snowshoe-like paws, the lynx can move effortlessly across deep snow that would trap other predators. These adaptations are crucial for hunting in its frigid, often snow-covered habitat. The lynx's thick, silvery-brown fur provides insulation against the cold and offers excellent camouflage among the trees and underbrush. The black tufts on its ears are not just for show. They are believed to enhance the lynx's already keen hearing, helping it detect even the faintest sounds in its environment. The Canada lynx is a specialist predator, with its primary prey being the snowshoe hare. This predator-prey relationship is so closely linked that the population of the lynx rises and falls almost in sync with the cyclical population of the hares. Every 8 to 11 years, as the snowshoe hare population peaks and then declines, so too does the number of lynxes. This unique dynamic illustrates the delicate balance of nature in these northern forests. Though the lynx can hunt other small mammals and birds, it's the snowshoe hare that makes up the bulk of its diet. The lynx relies on stealth and patience in its hunting strategy, often stalking its prey for hours, using the dense underbrush as cover before launching a swift and deadly pounce. Its sharp, retractable claws and powerful jaws make quick work of its prey. Canada lynxes are solitary and highly territorial animals, with individuals often covering vast areas of up to 115 square miles. These territories are marked with scent markings, and while males' and females' ranges may overlap, they typically avoid each other outside of the breeding season. Mating occurs in late winter, and after a gestation period of around 63 days, the female gives birth to a litter of one to four kittens, usually in a hidden den made from dense vegetation or a hollow log. These kittens are born blind and helpless, relying entirely on their mother for food and protection. They remain with her for about a year, learning essential survival skills before venturing out on their own. The survival rate of these young lynxes is closely tied to the availability of prey, particularly snowshoe hares. While the Canada lynx is not currently endangered, its habitat is increasingly under threat from human activities such as logging, mining, and the impacts of climate change. These activities not only fragment the lynx's habitat, but also affect the snowshoe hare populations, which are vital to the lynx's survival. Conservation efforts focus on preserving the dense forests that are essential for the survival of both the lynx and its prey, ensuring these silent hunters continue to thrive in their natural environment. The Canada lynx is a true symbol of the northern wilderness, a silent, solitary hunter perfectly attuned to the rhythms of its environment. Its presence is a reminder of the delicate balance that exists within these remote and pristine ecosystems and the ongoing need to protect them for future generations.